bug hit my nipple. Thank God it was just a bug. Just to let you know, Rad Power Bike stopped making the Rad Mini. For now, I guess. I'm not sure. I haven't been on the website, but that means my Rad Minis are like unique. Okay. All right. So yeah. Electric X Premium. Oh, this is new? Okay. <laughs> this is new, okay. All right. Hello everybody, welcome back. Sorry. I'm just getting used to uh, riding. I was thinking about where I'm going today. I start out, <clears throat> excuse me. <clears throat> I got a cold here, but I'm still riding. I actually feel slightly better with the cold. So I'm just gonna position myself here for a left turn. There we go. I'm not in a hurry, so we'll let the cars go by. So I'm taking the streets. <laughs> it's still a little wet. It's still wet out here. All right. I'm on the streets. I'm headed to the uh, sports park. I'm in my summer outfit. I brought a lot of snacks. I brought a lot of snacks and something to drink. And I plan on doing a live stream. Oh. I got a left turning. It's a yield.
kind of curious, is there a reason why it's not been done? Uh, I've known about like uh, all wheel drive electric e-bikes. The front has a motor, the, re the rear wheel has a motor. And there's an aerial rider, Gridley. Gridley? Grizzly. Sorry. My mouth is starting to dry a little. I have a head cold, but I'm still able to ride the bike. It's not much of a cold. Oh. I'm wearing uh, my compression tights. Sorry, when I see traffic, I always look. Uh, I always look around. So, like like the aerial grizzly, like it's two wheel drive. It's novel, but there's some redundancy to it. So I'm thinking until I see some other videos with some real, real live, you know, riding footage. Slightly skeptical. Slightly. I think in theory it'll work because uh, you're working off the uh, little bug hit my knuckle. Thank God it was just a bug. And so in theory it should work because you're using the gears. That's where you're getting the. Uh, the extra, I don't know, torque or uh, maybe speed. You're getting it through the gearing. And that has this uh, uniqueness to it, but I've never seen it on a, on a fat tire, on a <laughs> fat electric, fat electric folding tire. Did, Basically a Rad Mini <laughs> with a mid-drive to me, since I'm used to riding Rad. So that, just to let you know, Rad Power Bike stopped making the Rad Mini. For now, I guess. I'm not sure, I haven't been on the website, but that means my Rad Minis are like unique. Okay, all right. So anyway, so. Electric X Premium. Which way am I gonna go? I'm gonna stick with this right now. Stick with this. I'm gonna go on the uh, 
if there's no if there's no people walking or not many people walking, I'm gonna go on the, the gravel trail to the sports park. It's my original goal here. Because I haven't seen it yet. It should be drier. I'm just looking around. Okay. Alright. So yeah. Electric X Premium. It's it's definitely an, an interesting bike. Look, someone's <laughs> someone's car is being towed. Don't know why. Maybe a little accident. So Electric X Premium. I think it's going to be a different ride. But how much of a difference? Anyways, pros and cons are like. Uh, it works your your gears. It works your chain. And uh, that's the drawback of it. Maintenance drawback anyways. Look at okay, branches. Okay. Uh, a little wet right here. So I like to see some real-world <laughs> reviews of the uh, X Premium. Because the, the problem with ordering, like from direct, from direct to consumer kind of markets, is um, you don't get to try it out first. You know, it's the only thing about it. The other thing is. Uh, pain of returning it. I don't know how easy or simple it is. You're getting a, you know, 70 pound bike. Got to just jump that tire, the front one anyway. Small little branch. So, yeah, that, that's the only other thing, but it's, and then the other thing, it's it's kind of like in a pre-order stage right now, as of making this video. Uh, the Electric X Premium is pre-order stage, so who knows how long it's going to take. It may take a very long time. It seems like the uh, everyone's going to kind of like a pre-order, uh, mainly because supply chain. So. They introduce a prototype, usually make a pre-order, tell you it's like four week lead time. It's essentially a uh, crude form of uh, not crowdfunding, but uh, pretty close to crowdfunding. But anyways, it's, I think it's, you'll get your bike. I think you'll get your bike. It's just how long is it really gonna take? You know, are you going to get it in June? Are you going to get it in August, September, December, January next year? Always seems to be some delay. And, and there's a reason for delay, right? It's because you have to pay the shipping container, you have to ship it, you have to move things around. Oh, look at that. They're, re they're replacing these wooden poles with... Uh, these steel poles back here. Okay, I guess that's what they're doing. That's the uh, center point. Yeah, I got a got an email from the association. Center point is going to be working out here, and here they are. We just usually go around them. Oh yeah, that's easy. So when I get close to them, I'll just go on the grass. There's squirrels all over the place.
All right, so. So those are my thoughts on the electric X cranium. Oh, this is all, it's all dug up. It's all dug up here. Gotta take the machines, move this thing over here so it's gonna be on the grass. And I'm sure they'll fix it when it's done. Make it nice and, oh, this is new. Okay. <laughs> this is new, okay. All right. Uh, at least I can get through, I just had to slow down here. Which is, I think, a good idea because it's a blind corner. All right. All right, I think that's it. I'm not, I'm not gonna blare down so fast because uh, it's that time of year, people are out. You know, during like, in the heat of the summer, in the heat of the summer and the cold of the winter is probably the best time for me because no one comes out here during those times. It's either too hot or too cold. They go to the fitness center inside or they go into, they might have a machine, a walking machine in their house, you know, a lot of options. Or they don't take long walks. They just go around the block real quick. Because that heat will affect you. And then the supposed cold. Anyway, I'm gonna talk a little bit more about the Electric X Premium in my live stream. Should I buy it? We'll take a look at the website. We'll see what it says, what the lead time is and everything. I'm, I'm gonna, I brought my tablet. I brought, I think I brought everything. I brought the battery. So I'll do a live stream and talk about it. subscribe there's nobody here good that's what I want uh, consider joining membership I'm gonna change the way I do my videos I'm gonna go more into uh, member videos and uh, slowly put that put out uh, public videos so till next time bye <laughs>